Get them that well. They're too far. Let's start from the beginning. These are my friends Sophia, what? Taylor, what? Fatima, and my girlfriend Suzanne. Best thing to do with your friends is go camping. campsite that's two hours away to be exact in a town called Chapeño it's right next to the Rio Grande River which is also the border between USA and Mexico as soon as we got here we started getting ready to go canoeing on the river and this was actually some of their first times going canoeing that's Betty. Shout out to Betty for letting us use her canoe. Stay in the middle, don't freak out. Ready, let's go. Woo. go. Stay with the boat if it goes over, guys. All right, let me get in. Let's go. No. Now let's get you some rowing action. Me? To Fatima. So she, she can get a little action. Action. If you want to pass it to Taylor, you better not drop it, Taylor. Eyes on us. Are we up in the club? Hi. When we got back to shore, we were waiting for Taylor and Suzanne, because you can tell in the beginning of the video, it was hella windy. So it was hard to get around anyway. We bumped into it and scraped our heads off. Oh my god. Your glasses are gone? Yeah, $60 ones. Yep, One of the best parts about camping here is beautiful views that you can get from the valley. You get Mexico, the sunset, the river. It was perfect. some delicious burgers as you can tell. Oh. Yeah. Oh. Wow. Also, yeah. we saw this. I think it was their first time seeing something like that. In the morning, it was a little cold, rainy, and windy, but we were still able to make some good breakfast. Perfect weather for some hot chocolate. Fatima brought this ceramic pot to make traditional Mexican hot chocolate over the fire. Thanks, Fatima. Dude, what the fuck? 
Damn. <laughs> After a good ass meal, we got ready to bike. The best part about biking out here is how there is literally no one here. We had the roads all to ourselves. You can't really tell, but there was hella hills out here. Look when I made it. <laughs> Going down them was even better. Yo, that was a fast hill. What is that? Fatima, Taylor, and Suzanne found something interesting off find, the side Fatima? of the road. Show me, what did you find? A diary. What does it have? It has diaries. It has dreams. Dreams? Mm -hmm. Murder. Anger. Doubt. The second doubt. Murder. Anger. God. Um, it was a journal about this woman who wrote about her dreams and it seemed to be from 2016 till 2020 and it's just talking about god and her demons they sounded very vivid the first demon manifested anger the second doubt the third murder she was talking about something and the fourth four different manifestations happened we should take it back to the campsite But anyways, keep going, keep we going. headed back to camp to do one last thing. Yeah, just control it. Oh shit! Oh! Ah! 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 Bye, doggies. We love you. We went here, Salineño, Texas, which was also a small town that had like five Bro, roads and a birding center. Hosted by Winter Texan, who were very nice hosts by the way, and I've never seen anything like this where so many birds all in one place. <laughs> so, a few of the birds we saw was uh, green jay, cardinals, great kiskadees, chakalakas, red-winged blackbird, hummingbirds, orioles, and a few other ones I can't really remember. But it was just so amazing to see so many different species of birds all in one place. I've, I've never seen anything like it. And that's the end of the story. Thanks for watching.